Yeah, I'm fucking pissed, man. I take this goddamn boot camp fucking creator fucking test. Got as high as fucking 67%. You need 75 to pass to get the letter of recommendation. They got fucking questions on there that don't even play in the fucking video. Like, what the fuck is a watermark? That's not in a fucking video. Here's a goddamn test. See? Here's a fucking test. I tried different answers, and it didn't fucking matter. It still came to 67%. I tried beating the system. It came up to 67%. But if I would change... One question, and then you go down to 53. So what the fuck's the game, guys? I'm really goddamn pissed. All I want to do is get fucking paid. And I saw about the handicap, what Leafy is here. He got over three thirty thousand subscribers. And he's like, yay! <laughs> he got over thirty. Shit! Show me fucking thirty thousand subscribers so I can get paid. Yeah, yeah. I feel offended too by Leafy. Yeah, he's talking about old man with no teeth, and then you got this other lady on there, the, the messed up teeth. Oh, hey. I got messed up teeth, too. I, I used to have perfect teeth. See, this is all I got left. Yeah, I'll be 53. See my top ones? Cap. That's it. My top. That's my top ones. I'll be eating all that food and steak and everything. See, I hope that I get paid so I can get my teeth fixed. That's why I'm doing this shit. And y'all say, whoa, look at his face. Yeah, he looks like a goddamn monster. Y'all don't know what I've been through. You watch my videos and you don't know what I've been through. In my whole goddamn life, I was picked on, bullied, you know, beaten. My whole goddamn life from childhood. I grew up on Brown Street. Motherfuckers, you know, at work, the inmates say, how did you survive? Crazy, well, survive. I learned how to motherfucking run real quick, real fast. And they would laugh and say, damn, that motherfucker gone. That white boy gone. I would open it up into fucking warp zone. I found out if I ran on my tippy toes, I ran even faster. Because if you run flat, you know, flop, 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 you know. You don't go faster that way. You get on your tippy toes. You know, I ran, would run so fast. Like I said, I used to chase the city buses. You know, and running from the motherfuckers wanting to beat my ass. <laughs> I went for South Division High School and I broke every goddamn record there was. I may believe the motherfuckers were chasing my ass to beat me up. <laughs> Yeah, I used to have this jewelry curl and the afro and shit, but that probably slowed me down. That's what other people said. They slowed me down. <laughs> that shit didn't slow me down that much. But yeah, my head was back like this. My body was forward. <laughs> but uh, I broke every motherfucking record in the fucking school, man. I beat everybody. Yeah, back in the day, I was the fucking Superman. Yeah. But, uh, man, yeah, Leafy. Uh, that's not right. You don't want to talk about people like that. I like me with my teeth power. <laughs> you don't like me because I got bad teeth? Well, it's not my fault. You know, sure, I used to brush my teeth all the time, but when I was younger, I ate a lot of candy. So y'all kids, stop eating that goddamn candy. But my bottom teeth are perfect, see? Yeah. All my teeth used to be perfect. 
They don't want to see this fucking Dr. Brooks. And then he started grinding holes in them and shit, filling them with bubble gum. And then I smoked crack cocaine. Oh, did I say that? <laughs> and the, the feeling, well, he did tell me they were temporary feelings. Yeah. See, I was going to go back and have them, you know, put permanent feelings in. But then my motor went on on my truck. So I had to make a choice. Either pay $1,000 to get my teeth fixed. Or pay three thousand dollars for a new motor in my truck because I had nothing to drive. So that, I've been in debt since. But hopefully, someday, I will get paid from YouTube and get my smile back. Yeah, I used to have a gorgeous smile. Y'all see my picture? I'll show you my picture. I'll show you a picture. I don't know if I'm really showing my teeth here, but no, not that much. Uh, yeah. Wasn't that cutie? That's before the monsters got a hold of me. Yeah. That's before the monsters got a hold of me. So if y'all women hook up to me, this is what your kids will look like. Cute. Wasn't I cute? Yeah, that was me. Look at that. Picture day. I remember this day. I, 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 I called my hair straight back and spiked it out. And the teacher come over and she goes, no, 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 not like that. No, 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 that's going to ruin the picture. So if you see, bitch took a comb, put some spit on my hair or whatever, flattened it down and combed it like that. See how the sides and that were sticking up? I was coming it straight back, man. Uh, you know, it spiked out. Nah, nah, nah. Bitch. That's the way I wanted to look. But she wanted me to look right. See how people do that? See how people do that? They wanted you to look right. And you could tell she did a fucked up job on my hair. You know? Looks red, don't it? What? Is that a redhead? That's what my daddy thought. My daddy thought that uh, my mom had sex with this redhead guy. Does my hair look red? No. I'm fucking Hungarian. Alright? Well, I do got Irish in me because my mom was Irish. I never really had much of smell for when I was a kid. What can the shit beat out of me every day? Well, that's before the, the shit started. Yeah. Back in the 70s, it wasn't so fucking bad, but. Or was it the 60s? I don't know what age I was. I was probably eight years old there. Yeah. So later on, that's when it started. Yeah. So let's see. Uh. I was born in 63, so if I was 8 years old, I was 11? I was 11 years old in that picture? No. Let me see. I ain't got any numbers. Yeah. Yeah, wait. Yeah. 
I started late because I was born on December 9th. So, yeah, I was seven years old. Kindergarten. I remember that shit. I started late. I was held back a year. When I was fucking 18. I was in fucking junior. Yeah, I was a junior. 18 years old. That's when I fucking dropped out. Because they told me that uh, I needed three more credits. So if I'd come back as a senior, I'd still have to come back one more year after that to graduate. Everybody else would have graduated, but I wouldn't uh, graduate because I was three credits behind. That's what happens when you get tossed from school to school to school. Yeah. I had a fucking rough life. Bad fucking life. And I was talking to my boss, you know, he's like, yeah, I talked to my boss about that. Uh, he goes, Kyle, sometimes in life, you know, a man has to make a choice, you know, to go on down this road. Sometimes the road splits off to other directions. He goes, I believe you took the wrong turn. Now, if you would have took the other turn, maybe your life would have been a lot better. And then I was thinking to myself, I told him this. I was thinking to myself, well, if I didn't take that turn, I wouldn't have found you. He goes, Carl, maybe that was my point. Oh. He is so fucking mean. He just wants to smash my fucking flowers and tear up all my pictures. What a motherfucking hater. He's the one. It says, y'all don't like me, and y'all don't care about to see me. Y'all don't want to see me stuff my face, and y'all don't want to hear me sing and tell stupid jokes. He's a goddamn hater. My boss. He's a goddamn hater. But y'all have proven to me, y'all do like me. Yeah, and I like that. I love you guys. I love you guys. Keep viewing and keep subscribing, pissing him off. Oh, he's getting quiet now. 55 subscribers, 6,500 uh, 6, views. Yeah, he's getting quiet now. Yeah, keep it up. I hope this video here gets more so I can get my teeth fixed and be somebody. You know, I hate being the guy that gets pushed down and thrown around just because he ain't a somebody. Well, I am a somebody. I know I am. Because I wouldn't be here right now if I wasn't a somebody. I am Carl Cash. I am an entertainer comedian. All right? Yeah. Carl Cash, YouTube, subscribe. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, here's that fucking test score again. See that? There it is. Y'all want to copy it? It's only 67%. But see how I changed the numbers? The letters? See that? Number four. See that? Number four was B. I changed to D. Number 13. Number 13 was D. I changed it to C. Number two. I changed it to D. See that? I changed it to D and it was C. And it didn't fucking matter. It's still 67%. Now, how can that be? Yeah, how can that be? I changed three fucking questions. And it still came to 67%. Then I started really looking at the, the questions and the answers. I really started looking at them, and they all look like they're all the same. That they all connect. I watched the video... Watch the video fucking four fucking times. And still, 67%. I'm trying this and I'm trying that and I'm trying this and trying that. And it's like reading it over and over and doing it over and over. I give up. My boss, the hater, yeah, he said, he, Carl, I took your YouTube Academy quiz I got 87% first fucking try and I didn't watch the video he's actually I was kind of disappointed with that because he's such a goddamn brain 
You know, yeah, I give him credit. He's book smart, you know, but I'm street smart. Yeah, I would survive better out in the street than he would. Yeah, this other guy at work, his name's uh, James or whatever. And uh, he told me that my boss don't like hunting in the woods at night. He's scared. Even with a gun, he's scared. But this James guy that, that I know, that I worked with his daddy, whatever, he says he does go. He says just a little tiny guy. He says, imagine little tiny guy with a gun goes walking through the woods at night. Get him some food. He said, now who's the coward? Yeah. Not the little guy with the gun. It's the big guy with the gun and the knife. He won't go in the woods at night. Hmm. He says, maybe I should ask him about that. What's the matter, Howard? Huh? You're afraid of the goddamn boogeyman, you fucking bully? Yeah. So I'm going to send this one all to Leafy. I'm not going to do like the handicapped guy. I feel sorry for you. you know, I'm not cutting you down or nothing, but, uh, you know, he's right. You, no one deserves to be bullied. Bullies should be fucking cut. That's what my boss is doing to me. So I hear you, little fella. I hear you. Because I get bullied too. And because of my teeth. I don't show them off because. They, huh. You gotta make fun of me too? Leafy is here? Yeah. This one goes out to Leafy. Stop being a bully, Leafy. Everybody has their quirks and problems and mishaps. It's not our fault. It's just the way God wants us to be. Now, if I was perfect and beautiful, you know what? I'd probably have just as much as problems as all those other cute guys. Yeah, women. Women just can't leave him alone. Oh, he's so damn hot. He's so damn fine. Well, of course, they're going to have sex with every woman they can because they can. What happens? They get caught up. They find out. And what happens? Mama drama. Hey, I took a bat right to his windows, popped all his lights and cut all four tires and slashed his serb bourbon seeds. Next time he, he's going to learn when he cheats. That song should be banned. Yeah. I took a far away iron to his leather seats. Yeah. Next time he's going to learn when he cheats. See, that's a problem with the cute guys. Y'all want me to keep seeing them, keep hanging out with them cute guys. Yeah, you, you keep getting banged by them cute guys and keep getting fucked over. When those ugly guys wish to have just one woman. Oh, just one. A lot of women tell me, they say, don't ever change. Men tell me, <laughs> get this, I'm fucking confused. Men tell me, I can't get a woman because the way I act. <laughs> so I don't understand, is this a trick that you women tell me, that don't ever change? They say I'm a nice, gentle guy, I'm a happy guy. They tell me don't ever change. You know? And someday I will <laughs> find a woman. Uh, someday I will find a woman. Even with my messed up teeth. See, if there is a good woman out there, she's going to look beyond my teeth and my face. The scars. You know, I had a lot of acne. Because yeah, I used to get the shit beat on me every fucking day. Let's get that honky. Yeah, let's kick that honky's ass. And that was a lot of stress for me. Once I moved up north away from Milwaukee, the acne went away. All that stress went away. Uh, it all went away. It was just stress. Stress in a teenager. Teenagers. Had, and I weight lifted. You know, I weight lifted to get over that. It made me feel better about myself. Well, see, now. As I'm getting older, which I always wanted to be. I always wanted to be older. 
Yeah. When people would say, why would you want to be old? Well, when I hung out with my dad, all his buddies were older, and I liked how they lived. They all had the fancy trucks. They all had the fancy boats. They all had the fancy life, you know, good money, good houses, got kids, dog named Spot. I wanted to have a life like that. Yeah. So here I am on YouTube trying to get paid. So I can live my happy little life. Yeah. I'm only 52, so I, I at least got, you know, 30 years ago. Show me something. Show me a woman. Hell, I heard I still have a chance to make a baby. Yeah. I knew a guy, 76 years old, and had a kid. Too bad he died, you know, like three years later or something like that. It's sad. Looked me in the eye and says, I had diarrhea for the last three days. I don't feel so well. He died. Uh, I don't remember what it was, but he died. And he had a little girl, about three years old. Sad. I oh, hope to God that don't happen to me. I hope someday I'm going to be rich and famous. Find me a woman. Have a couple kids and get my own house. You know, maybe get a boat. Get some life preservers. Get them. And you heard that story about you know, where I was drowned by this fat black chick. I'm not, not segregating or whatever. Hell, I own seven color TVs <laughs> for black and whites. I'm not prejudiced. <laughs> yeah, hell. Everybody's the same. That's what I say. Everybody's the same. Because when you cut them open, they bleed red. But if they bleed green, I might be a little worried. Damn, he got green blood. I knew there was fucking aliens out there. Yeah. Sure. Whoop, whoop. Anyways, yeah, I'm gonna put this out to Leafy. Let's see if I get 30,000 fucking subscribers. Yeah, Leafy, stop fucking bullying people. Stop the fucking hating. Uh, it's hating. You know, you hate people with bad teeth. Well, you hate me too? Just like the disabled guy. You know, he has a bone disease or whatever. I don't have a bone disease, but I have a facial disease and I got a teeth disease. And you hurt my feelings. You know that? You hurt my feelings, Leafy. Quit picking on people. I'm serious. Quit picking on people. If you're going to pick on anybody, pick on yourself. For what you do. You should feel bad. You should take all your fucking millions and billions and help motherfucking people instead of pick at them. This is Carl Kishane. See you again real soon. Catch you again later. Yeah. This one goes all to you, Leafy. Stop being a bully. Just because we're old and we got fucked up teeth don't mean you got the right to laugh at us. How would you like to be laughed at? How would you like to be put in a fucking cage and have people throw popcorn at you and laugh at you like a goddamn monkey? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There's white monkeys out there. Yeah, I call them sea monkeys. See? <laughs> See the monkey? <laughs> it's sea monkey. <laughs> Watch out for the goddamn gorilla, because I'm the white gorilla. Peace out.